Say one thing, please. Defend yourself. So, look, I'm so, I came out here not completely prepared. Well, because it doesn't exist. So here's the thing: the talking point is factless. The Palestinian Authority exists as a governance structure over now what is truly Judea and Samaria, which has always been Israel. Do you know where the word Palestine comes from? You probably don't. Uh, Arabia Palestiniana, no, which was the Roman it was Philistine. Province. It was Philistine, which is an Arabia, uh, which is a Roman term, which only goes back about you know 1,400 years. Israel has always been the home of the Jews, dating back for 3,500 plus years. What's up, YouTube? Hope, hope you guys are feeling good. Today, guys, we're back giving a new video. Today, we're going to check out Charlie Kick. I call Charlie Kick. He loves kicking us. Um, demolishes knife pro Palestinian students. Okay, let's give this a try. I think that the um, determination of the Israeli capital should be something that should be settled in a Israeli-Palestinian bilateral negotiation for the creation of a Palestinian state, which is something that the Palestinian people his voice should is be low. able to have. They should be able to have freedom. They should. So they do have freedom. What freedoms do the Palestinian people not have right now? Well, I mean, currently. Name one freedom. Uh, have you been to the West Bank? Something they lack freedom freedom of movement. Sure they do. An Arab in the Palestinian Authority can travel to Israel, Jordan, Syria, Lebanon, in and out with any sort of restriction. I've been to Judea and Samaria. I've been to Hebron. I've been to the Golan Heights. As a Christian, thankfully, I'm allowed in there. You know, all my Jewish tour guides and my IDF friends as Jews are not allowed in the West Bank. Why? So what freedom don't they have? Well, you know. No, I don't know. Can you name one freedom that the Palestinian people do not have? I mean, look. Or, or is that just a talking point with no evidence? Look, sophistry aside for both of us, I, you know, just, there's an, there's an imbalance here between what the, between Israel and Palestine that the current Israeli government what imbalance? Can you build it out for me? Because there's, you, have, you haven't been able to name a freedom they don't have. Did you know that the Israeli government gave up the Gaza Strip in pursuit of peace in 2006? And it was immediately taken over. 10,000 Jewish settlers left the Gaza Strip in pursuit of peace in 2006. And it was immediately taken over by the terrorist group Hamas, which is one of the richest parts of Israel. Israel, Israel, Israel gave it up voluntarily because they thought it would give them peace. And they, the PA didn't give it to them. So what freedoms does the PA not have? Well, I mean... Honestly, this is really important because you come up here and say Alan Omar said nothing wrong. You make a factless, evidence, you know, totally absent of evidence statement the Palestinian people don't have freedom. Say one thing, please. Defend yourself. So, look, I'm so, I came out here not completely prepared. Well, because with, it doesn't exist. So here's the thing the talking point is factless. The Palestinian Authority exists as a governance structure over now what is truly Judea and Samaria, which has always been Israel. Do you know where the word Palestine comes from? You probably don't. Uh, Arabia Palestiniana, no, which was the Roman it was Philistine. province. It was Philistine, which is, an Arabi uh, which is a Roman term, which only goes back about you know, 1,400 years. Israel has always been the home of the Jews, dating back for 3,500 plus Streets. years. Israel Fox, is yeah. mentioned over 635 times in the Torah. Jerusalem has zero religious significance in the Quran at all to the Arab Muslim people, yet it's mentioned 637 times. Yet under Israeli control, the Arabs and the Muslims still get total and complete access to their holy sites. Yet where the Arabs huh. control areas, the Jews are not allowed to visit there whatsoever. Why is that the Palestinian Authority pays the families of terrorists that kills Jews? They have a pay for slay policy. Thank God that President Trump just finally defunded it. I encourage you one thing. Don't believe the facts and the narrative that are just coming from the media because you're just wrong here and you obviously can't defend your position. Go and visit the West Bank yourself. You'll see the facts up and close because you're incorrect. So this was actually beautiful to watch. Is, you see people who come up with, with <coughs> minor facts, without overinvesting there in the first place, and coming out to come and challenge Charlie Kick without having enough, <clears throat> enough research, you, 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 you're going to be kicked out. Because Charlie is someone who I've visited there before. He's telling you what he has seen, what he has experienced, what he has heard, and how things have been operated right there in the Western Bank. So the funny thing about this Palestine and Israel, and Israel giving up the land to Palestine, the Gaza, is that the, the land itself do not belong to Palestine. And it's something they never want to accept. It's never belonged to Palestine, but the Israeli choose to give it up to 
to the Palestine in 2006, there was war, there was riot. I, I don't know if you guys watched the, the fights and stuff that happened in 2006, also 2010. I think it happened in 2010, too. There, there was kind of like arguments. Um, people were talking, yeah, this is our land, this is our land. Okay, the Israel, like, because, let's have peace. You guys can take the land. A lot of Israel left the land to find better greener pastures, even though they have properties, assets in Gaza, they left it. Fast forward to now, another war again. Another war again happening right there. Israel and Palestine. And the funny thing is that the Gaza that, that, that Palestine are residing now on, the land itself do not belong to them, but was given to them for peace to be maintained. And the land was colonized, I'll use the word colonized by Hamas, a terrorist organization that was labeled terrorist organization. They were labeled. Gaza is way more poor than it was 2006. Gaza has less schools, less hospitals, less infrastructures right now. Why? It's because of the terrorist organization that resides there in Gaza. Hamas. Palestine are not facing their problem, but they just want to blame it at Israel. Every single time. It's something that they don't want to talk about. For peace to reign, Israel keeps on going against their own self to please people. The land that the Palestine are fighting for belongs to the Israel. You could go make your own research. The land Palestine are fighting for. Palestine is, they never existed before. The word Palestine, even in the country named Palestine, never existed before. They just came. The Arab came. So if you, if you do your history class, if you go to search the history, you will know that this war they are fighting should not even had happened in the first place. So what we should be battling now is the terrorist organization that are operating in Gaza, which is Hamas. That is, that is what we should be talking about. Palestinians know what is happening, know who is at fault, but they don't voice it out. They just want to blame it on Israel every single time. According to my research I've made, if you watch October 7th, if you see what happened October 7th, the killings of Israel, of Israeli, like a lot of them died that day. By who? Hamas. During the ceremony that Israel were having, they just killed a lot of their father, mother, children. They killed them. So this guy coming here to say this, um, I love how Charlie put it straight to him, like, you have no points. Go make more research. Don't come here being naive. Comment down below, think about this video, give us a thumbs up. Share this video as many as you can subscribe to our channel. I will see you guys in the next video. Make sure you stay safe. I just bought a bag, like an old lady. I'm back, wood smoking, I don't know, papers, pass that 808. That don't, don't shake her. Oh, bitch, you know I'm grinding like a pro skater. Baby, mama bugging, I'm so quick to 